Hey there, this is Chris Doyle at Alderman Chevrolet GMC in Rutland, Vermont, Vermont's favorite car dealership. Thank you for your inquiry on this really impressive vehicle. This is the 2024 GMC Yukon XL Denali Ultimate. This is the top of the line version of the Yukon XL finished off in the Onyx Black. Denali Ultimate pretty much is exactly what it sounds like. This is the everything version. Um, <laughs> it would be a shorter video if I just listed the things that this car doesn't have, but I'm just gonna give you the highlights so you're not watching a Scorsese length film here. Uh, 6.2 liter V8, 10 speed automatic, uh, beautiful car, really nicely equipped. You can tell it's that Denali because it's that specific Denali grill, kind of chromed in black, chrome and black, great looking car. Uh, LEDs all the way around, headlights, taillights, daytime running lamps, fog lamps up front. Uh, again, as the Denali Ultimate, uh, upgraded tires, upgraded rims, just a great looking vehicle all the way around. The Yukon XL, of course, is GMC's biggest SUV. It's the GMC twin to the Chevy Suburban. So plenty of room for seven passengers to ride in a lot of comfort <laughs> on the road. I'm gonna open this up. You will see those automatic power retractable uh, steps come down. Beautiful interior, Alpine Umber is what they call it. Uh, but just that really nice, um, I call it tan, but that really nice, really high quality uh, interior. Um, kind of the markings on here. A lot of these are topographical maps from Mount Denali, believe it or not. Yeah, I know it's little stuff, but hey, it's a beautiful car. So I'm gonna hop inside just so you can see uh, all the way around. We do have, here I am, how you doing? Kiss it. There's a face behind this. Uh, there. We've got our, our infotainment screens for the folks in the second row. Um, no more DVDs anymore. Those days have gone by, so all parable to devices and lots of different things that can be watched on there too. Of course, we do have our Tri-Zone automatic climate control up front and for the folks in the back. Power outlet down here, USB A and C ports and heated seats. For the folks in the second row it is the bose performance series system incredible sounding sound system in this particular vehicle uh lots of room in the yukon xl as you can imagine you've got plenty of room very comfortable even in the third row with a lot of leg room lots of headroom and uh, what do you know, on a day like today, when the sun's out, it's gonna be 90 degrees, not a cloud in the sky, and a beautiful full-sized panoramic moonroof stretches all the way over into the second row. Uh, we're gonna get a closer look at what's going on in the dash up front in just a minute, but I want you to be able to see all of it uh, at once. So hopping in the front, again, it, the things you would imagine, that just gonna go without saying with this car. Um, if you want it, it's got it. Kind of seems that way. You've got your memory seating. We have our full power seat with massage feature. It's, it is pretty cool. I've actually tried that a couple of times. Um, the basics, two wheel drive, all wheel drive, four wheel drive, high and low, and different drive modes that you can put in. Off-road, sport, normal, um, terrain modes. Uh, very easy to shift. Lots of features here from your parking assist front and rear, lane keep assist when you're driving, uh, automatic parking assist. Uh, I guess you can use it for um, for perpendicular parking too, but honestly, I, it's the parallel parking that I really like. And I'm going to sit in here. Oh, we even have a trailer brake controller in here as well. Uh, hopefully you can see this. I can never really tell if it comes through, but we do have the heads up display and that is configurable. Lots of different things that you go and hopefully this comes through on the video. <laughs> I'm not really sure. What is this? Super Cruise. So we've got the Super Cruise um, assisted driving system uh, in this vehicle. That's what this is right here. Works with the adaptive controls control. I think we're up to something like 400,000 miles worth of roads that this works on in America. Really, really cool stuff. That is there to make sure you're still looking forward. No taking a nap in the back while you're driving, but 
Uh, really great feature, especially on longer drives. Of course, we've got the full console here and heated and cooled seats up front. Even more storage along with wireless charging for your phone there. And then up on the main touchscreen. And it's worth noting, this console is only available in the Denali. This particular configuration is unique to the Denali. And uh, you know, there's your Denali edition kind of badging on there. Really cool stuff here too. Oh, and worth pointing out as well, that little ultimate badge. Look up. Yes, the Bose sound system even has speakers in the headrests. It does, I turn it on, my little iPhone is not gonna capture how good it sounds, but it is pretty remarkable. Your audio, AM, FM, satellite, radio, Bluetooth for phone and music, App Droid Auto, Apple CarPlay, which is wireless, uh, Google Assistant, Play Store and Google Maps connectivity too. Just so many things that you can bring up here. I'm gonna shift this into reverse just so you can see here very configurable here too. We've got our overhead view. We've got our view down the back of the car. We've got our view up and back on the side of the vehicle. We have the top down view. I mean, there's a lot of things, as you can tell, that you can pull up here um, just so you can make sure that you're piloting a very large vehicle around safely. I mean, tons of safety features coming too, but that visibility does make a really big difference here. So I'm gonna put this back in the park. Oh, and one more thing, which I think is a really nice thing. There's my little mirror, which is also a nice widescreen camera for the back. That can be helpful if you look in your mirror and you see nothing but heads or stuff in the second and third row behind you. So that's something that you can turn on pretty much at any point. As is always the case for all of the Yukon XLs, room, plenty of room. So if I open this up, and this is hands-free as well for the power lift gate, but if you have that third row up, even with the third row up, you have a really big full-sized cargo area in the back with even a little bit more storage underneath for kind of little things that can move around. We've got another power outlet and the ability to raise and drop the third row and drop the second row. You can also control some of the seats from up front too. Again, big car, but you want to have the ability to do this easily without running around in circles <laughs> around the Yukon to be able to get it done. Close that. Here's that nice Denali badge. And of course, with that 6.2, we've got the twin tailpipes on either side. Uh, you know, one thing I can't kind of convey through this, but it is worth pointing out, especially with the redesign of these and the magnetic ride suspensions that are available in these vehicles. Yes, it is a big car. There is no doubt about it, but it doesn't ride like a big, stiff truck. The ride is remarkable finely tuned, very comfortable without numbing you and insulating you from the road. They've really done a great job. It is a fun car to park. It is remarkably agile. Again, this is something that is not just meant to be uh, for the 9,000 mile trip on the road. Uh, a lot of people do use these as daily drivers and yes, big car, but you know, very easy to drive and very easy to live with. And just a beauty uh, all the way around. So there you have it, the 2024 GMC Yukon XL Denali Ultimate. If you'd like to learn more about this Denali Ultimate, if you're watching this video on Facebook, you can click on the Learn More button. If you're watching it on YouTube, you can click on the link in the comments below, or better yet, just come see it in person. We're at 65 Windcrest Road in Rutland, Vermont, just off Route 7 South. Hope to see you soon.